Hands, of course, of Dick Craven, but on the inside we've got Ray and Jack Picard, another early 90s uh, merchant. The Ray always did race hard. This isn't a demonstration for Ray, this is I want to win. And don't we all, as Rob Bradley gets his own outfit going, going red in the face. But it's Ray and Jack Picard on the Kawasaki at the front and that beautiful Triumph twin engined bike that was John Whittaker's back in the day goes into the lead of all things with Dick Craven. It was the race back in the 60s and early 70s and he's having a go this afternoon, 50 years later, round picker, isn't that incredible, on that Triumph engine machine, absolutely loving it. So there you go, around a long, long time and showing the young ones how it's done down the back straight. It's Gordon Bennington now getting the hang of Rob Bradley's outfit at the back with Rob in the chair. So it could be interesting later on because Ray Picard will have a race on his hands later for sure. So good to see that old Triumph outfit. That's how I remember outfits when I was a kid, built just like that. And there you go, and doesn't it sound wonderful down the back straight? Absolutely wonderful. Your R1 engines of your Rob Bradley's machine may sound good, but music to my ears is this beautiful Triumph engine taking the win for Dick Craven and John Arco. Fantastic. I bet he never thought he'd win a race again as he comes down to take the win. Number three, John Hildreth, of course, and Stuart Taylor. Then Gordon Bennington and Rob Bradley.